All right, sports fans, how you doing? Kevin O'Neill here with Storm Team 2. You know, it's not just us with the crummy weekends. It has been uh, about 100 million uh, North Americans in uh, Canada and U.S. are just frustrated with the weather we're having around the Great Lakes and for New England, New York. Uh, just bad timing for these areas of low pressure coming in, giving us a lot of cloud cover. Uh, some showers today. Again, I emphasize a lot of dry time today. Low 50s will be our high today. Uh, mid 40s tomorrow. Uh, both days will be breezy, gusts up to 30 miles per hour. A sunny Monday and warmer Tuesday and Wednesday. Our average high for today's date in Buffalo statistically is 58 degrees. I got us down for 52, so below average temperatures. And, and again, we'll be measuring our rain, maybe a, a tenth of an inch of rain or less uh, today for Buffalo. A rivalry weekend uh, continues. Uh, it was uh, West Seneca West, West Seneca East. Uh, Ken West, Ken East plays this weekend. Uh, Williamsville North at Lockport today and some showers are possible uh, wherever you are in Western New York for your outdoor plans. Have an umbrella standing by, but be aware of a lot of dry time today. Uh, Bill, it's raining in Foxborough, probably as you view this, if you're viewing this on Saturday, uh, but it should clear off in time. Again, if you're going to the game, uh, driving or flying, uh, I think the game itself will be mid 50s. A little on the breezy side again, some gusts up to 30 miles per hour, but not a weather game except for some uh, gusty winds there in New England. Uh, for us in uh, Buffalo, again, you will see some showers represented. Uh, the one thing I would add, and just being a native Western New Yorker and seeing this over and over and over and over again, and you too probably, uh, it w with flow from the Northwest, I could see some more lake showers for Chautauqua County. So I would have Chautauqua County having the most showers today, maybe Cat County second most, and, and you know, Batavia worse. And the rest of this I agree with. You didn't see a lot of flashes of green. I already went through it. So again, a lot of dry time today. The clouds hang around with some lake effect precipitation, rather sparse and fast moving. Okay, so again, if you have outdoor plans, keep them. Just be aware of some showers, especially for, for I would say, northern Chautauqua County. Tomorrow, again, you will see some flashes of green here. Uh, but a lot of dry time, okay, with some uh, widely scattered showers. I think we clear out by the afternoon and eventually it becomes partly cloudy, but chilly. Temperatures only in the 40s and on the breezy side as well. Uh, we're sunny on Monday, okay, if you're off Monday, you know, like I am. Good, good, good news. Uh, wind gusts, miles per hour, gusts up to 30 miles per hour. And so again, you know, Western New Yorkers know this. With wind from the northwest, it'll be southeast of the lakes, more prone for lake effect precipitation, okay? You know, when winds out of the southwest, Buffalo gets nailed, but winds out of the northwest, it is, you know, Dunkirk and, uh, uh, you know, Albion um, uh, for, because of their orientation with the Great Lakes. Uh, tomorrow, wind gusts again up to 30 miles per hour. So a chilly feel to the day for the next couple of days. Uh, in terms of rain amounts, nothing too impressive. I think the highest amounts will be, I would have Jamestown having the highest amounts instead of Ellicottville. Uh, you notice some areas get missed today. A lot of Western New Yorkers uh, do not get any showers today. So again, a lot of dry time today, but I do have to talk about some scattered shower possibilities, especially for the Southern tier. Uh, temperatures around 52 degrees for the high and gusts up to 30 miles per hour. Tomorrow, <sighs> scattered showers around in the morning. Highs only in the mid 40s and, and chilly. It's going to feel kind of like upper 30s. So if you're if, if tomorrow's your day for outdoor fun, really want to bundle yourself up, bundle the kids up, want to wear a winter hat, gloves. Hey, no judgment, man. It's going to be a chilly day tomorrow. OK, sun and calmer on Monday. A nice day. Best day for uh, family portraits, for driving around and looking at the leaves. Tuesday, mix of sun and clouds, upper 60s, best round for uh, the best day for a round of golf. That's what I'm doing. Uh, Wednesday, some shower chances later on in the day as clouds increase. Thursday morning, maybe. I don't have a graphic here. Maybe Thursday morning. Uh, the Bills have a home game Thursday night, and I think they should avoid showers. It'll be uh, you know, around 50 or so for the game. And it, as of now, it looks rain free. There is some what we call you know, model ambiguity long range. So Southern Tier, I do have a shower chance for you on Friday.